Hey guys, this is Paradwaj with Phone Arena. Right now we have the Zen Ultra Phone 701 HD in our hands and people have been asking us to do a games demo on this device so that's what I'm going to do now. So let's take a look at the games that we are going to show you now. So we have uh, some games installed here so I'm gonna show you four games. Uh, two graphically intensive games and two not so graphically intensive casual games. So the subway surface and Temple Run 2 both are endless running games and uh, I'm going to show you the uh, th those two casual games and I'm go also going to show you the Dead Trigger and Asphalt 7 two graphically intensive games that are really a test of the GPU. So this phone runs on a MediaTek MTK6589 processor and has the Power G, uh, Power VR SGX 544 MP2 GPU. So pretty powerful, which is uh, also uh, same as most of the phones in this price range, including the Mighty Max Canvas HD. So uh, not too powerful, but you know powerful enough for uh, the casual games to run ultra smooth, while it can run intensive games pretty well. So let's start with an inst intensive one. Let's open up Dead Trigger first. We've already played some of it, so it's going to show you uh, from the middle. So in the mission three or something, just an idea of the graphics performance and whatnot. So this is uh, mission three. As you can see here, amazing graphics and surprisingly really good really really good uh, gameplay All right. so that was that was very unfortunate let me escape and see if i'm able to So uh, the lighting effects, the texture, everything, everything is nice. Not too bad again. So that was a quick demo of uh, Dead Trigger on the Zen Ultraphone 701 HD. Pretty nice performance, like we expected that it would be good because this is a really good uh, graphics processor. Anyway, let's open up the second intensive game here, Asphalt 7. Takes a bit of a time to load. This is a huge game. Comes at uh, more than a gigabyte of size. And uh, regarding the storage issue on most of the phones, this phone doesn't have it. This phone can uh, write games and apps to the SD card directly. So installing huge games shouldn't be a problem. For some reason, the accelerometer uh, doesn't seem to work for this game alone. So I've changed the controls around and uh, this is based on uh, touchscreen controls, unlike other methods. Pretty nice graphics in this too, but uh, the graphics are not as great as we expected because uh, the textures are not as good as uh, on other phones. So it is really good on other phones. But still not bad. Perfectly adequate gameplay, I would say. So yeah, that was a quick look at Asphalt 7 on the Zen Ultraphone 701 HD. So let's take a look at the casual games now. First up, uh, Temple Run 2. I've already enabled uh, maximum graphics for this game, so as to you know gauge the performance levels 
uh, at the highest uh, graphic settings. It is built on the Unity engine and as you can see here the performance is not too bad at all. As you can notice uh, the dirt coming up and the water too so everything is like uh, enhanced because of uh, me selecting the high resolution uh, high graphics version. So yeah, uh, pretty neat. As expected, you know, performance is adequate and uh, as expected, the endless casual running games are going to perform well. Temple Run was too, uh, Temple Run 2 was good, so let's take a look at Subway Surfers. So this is also a very similar game. I don't know if you can notice but uh, this seems extremely fluid, uh, very fluid that you know probably uh, this might be up to 60 fps. This is really a good thing uh, for this chipset because uh, subway surfers even uh, older devices or perhaps uh, less powerful devices like the Galaxy S3 mini uh, used to underperform in the subway surfers game but this seems to be very very smooth so that was a quick demo of subway surfers on the zen ultra phone 701 hd uh, i think that's about it uh, to sum it up i think this is a good uh, gaming device i mean if you're going to play Asphalt 7, it'll perform good. It'll not look as good as on other phones, other powerful phones, but still it'll perform adequately well. Even Dead Trigger looked very similar to high-end phones and performed well. And Temple Run 2 and Subway Surfers don't have a problem at all. So if you're uh, thinking about gaming on this phone, it is fine. Uh, so that's about it. Uh, hit the like button if you like this video and uh, do subscribe to the channel for more videos like these. Thanks for watching.